wife always say, not clean enough. <laughs> Last. That was heavy. Are you watching the news? I don't have to. I'm watching the markets. I'll be trading pure alpha till close. All right. Hey, about that other thing. You know the score. Oh, yeah, yeah, absolutely. Let's do it. Put on a suit, look somewhat professional, and meet me at my warehouse off the LS freeway. Oh, uh, and I'm about to email you a link for the exchange. You can put in some trades of your own. I'm trying to stay off the day trading. Uh, but maybe I'll take a look. Is that his son's room? It is! Kinda cool. Alright, I'm trying to change my clothes, obviously. Here we go. We're supposed to put something professional on, right? Alright, we're good. Alright guys, last time we were Hanging out with Lester, went to that invader place, and yeah, craziness happened on TV. If you bought me a car, I wouldn't have to steal my sister. Uh, where is he? Where is he yelling from? Like, these kids are so ungrateful. Are you kidding me? You guys have everything. <gasps> you better chill, dude. I don't know if I should hit him or not. I won't. It's okay. I don't have the money to, to pay for that. Um, I don't know what I'm doing. Alright, on the map. Let's go to... <laughs> okay. There. Let's go to Lester. Alright, guys. I think we're here. Ouch! Oh, you see this driving? It's not okay. It's really not. Do we go on top of that roof? Like, why is there a ladder? Why do I always click that? I guess because I'm used to driving? There was no reason to go on the ladder, was there? Alright. The hell is this place? Garment factory. I needed a job that didn't require me to do anything apart from, uh, paying taxes. Okay, listen. Uh, shh, shh, shh. What do you got? The Holy Grail. The Union Depository. Now, they say it cannot be hit. It hasn't been yet. Look, I just owe some Mexican hood a couple million bucks I wrecked his girlfriend's house. I don't need to go crazy here. Which Mexican? Martin Madrazo. He's not supposed to be very nice. No, oh, when I met him, he was charming. <laughs> so what do you think? Oh, um, let's see. Either we hit a bank in the sticks or we do a store. Which do you like? Well, <clears throat> store's usually easier. But I gotta make a big take. Oh, well, gem as it is, then. Let's go to Vangelico, buy ourselves an engagement ring. Oh, we're gonna need a crew. I can round up some of the old guys. There are no old guys. Moses, uh, ironically, he found Jesus. Uh, all those... Irish crazies, they mostly just disappeared. That crew from the south, they all went down. There was a, an Eastern European guy making moves in Liberty City, but uh, yeah, he went quiet. All right. Well, we're gonna need a crew. You got any contacts in LS or not? I've been working with someone, but they're too unpredictable. I'll have to reach out to some other guys. All right. Our car is nice now. Thank goodness. We're going to Little Portola. Little Portola? What is that? Your FIB buddies, they uh, know you're back in business. FIB buddies? What are you talking about? I checked out the WPP thing. Doesn't look like any WITSEC program I'm aware of. Well, for starters, they, uh, they don't put witnesses up in multi-million dollar mansions in Rockford Hills. Well, maybe they thought this would be the best cover. And most witnesses don't transfer five-figure sums into a particular FIB agent's bank account every month. Of course, the money gets moved around and washed through a number of fronts, but the trail is there. Deposits and withdrawals, the same sum every month. Agent Dave Norton, white middle-aged divorcee, unremarkable career, except 
for one incident, the shooting of a notorious stick-up man, Michael Town. Yeah, 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 all right. Lester, I'm very impressed. Look, uh, we can talk about this another time. Uh, take these glasses. My eyesight's fine. They're fitted with a camera and a radio relay. I'm gonna run the operation from the car while you're in the store getting what we need. Oh, excuse you? What'd you call me? Alright, guys. Made it. Okay, so let's... Oh, whoa. Wait a second. Okay. So let's go over here. Mm-hmm. Okay, we need shots of the security features, the alarm system, ventilation, cameras. Okay, we'll look at some. Sir, thank you. The alarm keypad is on the left when you come in, uh, on the wall by the side door. Glasses are live, shoot away. All right, I got an idea of their CCTV setup. Uh, can you shoot an air vent in the alarm keypad? All right, what do we got here? Uh, surveillance and ventilation. Now all I'm after is the alarm. What is that exactly? Um, I don't know what that is. Would it? All I need is a shot of the alarm keypad. Okay, I got it. Oh, here we go. Shots come through. Camera check. Alarm check. Vents check. We good? good work. Now speak to the assistant and see if there's anything else we need to know. Yes, sir. Mr. Lester, sir. Hey, beautiful. I need to pick up a little something for the woman in my life. Well, one of them. <laughs> <laughs> sir, I'm sure we can help you. Tell me about her. What's her taste? Jeep, thank God. The same my wife we're talking about. <laughs> I don't know. I don't want to spend too much. I'm thinking maybe 10 grand. Our rings start at 8, our pendants start at 12. All right. So these things built to last, or am I just paying for the Vangelico logo here? <laughs> oh, no, 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 no. We use perfect clarity jewels 18 karat gold, 950 platinum. Nothing but the best. All right. I think you just made a sale. I'm gonna take a look around, think about it, come back to you, baby. Don't go anywhere. I understand. Okay. Thank you, sir. You got it. Come back to me. I'm coming back to you, buddy. Um. All right. So this is. We're like really. So we good? Almost. I need to get eyes on the roof of the building. See where the ventilation comes out. Okay. Drive around the block and look for a way up to the roof. Find an access point to the top of the roof. Okay, so this is going to be really hard. Hey, did you get it? Call me, okay? Look, there. Some construction. Yeah, if they're gutting the place, I might be able to get to the roof. Alright, let's go then. So, you keep up with the old crew? You know, after your death slash disappearance, there wasn't much holding us together. Yeah. You see him at all? After the incident? I kept tabs on him for a while, needed to uh, know that he didn't blame me. Yeah, where'd he go? North, south, east, west, wherever there were liquor stores to turn over and hitchhikers to disappear. Where did they bury him? They buried him? Not as far as I know. I saw a ladder. Climb up it and see if you can get to the roof. He's probably a John Doe then, right? What do you think? OD? Shootout? Maybe just a car crash, right? Anonymous charred remains on the highway? They only knew what a sick puppy they had on their hands. I'm on the roof! I need to know where the air coming out of those vents in Vangelico originates. There should be a unit above the store. Is that not it right there? 
Okay, wait. So it you have to get out of the camera in order to walk. That's really weird. Come on, hop over, buddy. Uh We need to know where those vents come out. Yeah. All right, I'm going, I'm going. Hey, I see the vents. Yeah, I'm looking at the relay. Can you get any higher? Alright, so I don't know if this is anything like the normal GTA games. It, are they. Do they usually have missions like this? I've never played one. I've already said that, but I've like never actually done any of the missions. It was just fun to steal cars, run away from cops, all that. So. I have no idea if this is normal. It's kind of cool though, I'm not going to lie. Let's hurry this up, Michael. You better shut up, you dork. I don't remember how to get down. Oh, wait, 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 wait. It's down there. Come on, go down faster. Where's the other ladder? Right here? All right. Go back down the stairs. If he says something else, I'm gonna be really annoyed. Here, take your glasses back. Let's go back to the garment factory. I called ahead and told him to start setting up the information. So, what did you see? Uh, nothing that'll cause undue complications. Yeah, it looked like a simple setup. Cameras broadcasting to a remote server. We might be able to wipe them remotely. Security guard on the door. He won't want to die for rich assholes to rub his nose in it. Uh, good. Alarm system's linked to the door lock. Uh, we'll get a good window if someone talented hacks it. Anything else? Well, the uh, more valuable merchandise is a in the cabinets in the center of the store, by the register. I might start there. Mm. Glass in the cabinets wasn't bulletproof. Means you can smash them easy enough, but the stones will be in the safe at night. So, we go in when it's open, then? Right. Once we melt down the gold, recut the rocks, that's an okay score. Yeah, shame we can't go in after hours, man. Those vents look promising. You know, might be able to flip that another way. I'm listening. Wait till we get back. About the crew. Yeah? There's this kid who's been helping me. Maybe we could cut him in. I don't work with amateurs. He ain't an amateur. Or if he is, he's a gifted amateur about to turn pro. He's a good kid, Lester. You know what they say. It's your funeral. One of them, at least. Ha ha ha. Ha ha Alright, I just went to the wrong area of this parking lot. <laughs> uh, workers have their uses. Okay, let me set this up. <laughs> nice to see the methods haven't changed. Well, we gotta figure out what we're doing somehow. All the crews, the rolls, prep work. Don't want to leave evidence behind on a hard drive. So yeah, the uh, methods don't change. Right, not for a pro. <laughs> well, mapping out the options. I'm showing you all the angles. That's my area of professional expertise. But 
making decisions. That is your domain, my friend. Here. There's two ways I see of doing this. We go in smart, or we go in loud and dumb. Remember the vents? If we're gonna be smart, we pump a little knockout gas through the air system, then hit the cabinets while everyone's out. You'll have to source the gas, of course, but crowd control won't slow you down, and that might improve the take. The cover is pest control, so no one will look twice when you're wearing gas masks. It means getting a pest control van, though. You go in dumb, and you'll need your, uh, famous way with people and four carbine rifles. But we can't buy them and risk them getting traced. No, 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 we've got to find some in circulation. It's awkward, it's, uh, <laughs> real awkward, but this is the gun favored by LSPD tactical teams, so one of their vans is probably a good place to look. A hacker can disable the cameras. The length of time depends on their ability. The alarm will be operating on the same window. The exit strategy is more or less the same for both options. The driver you pick will, of course, source some bikes. You come out of the store and make your way through the new subway tunnel they're digging off the Del Perro freeway. You lose the cops in there and meet a truck in the L.S. River. All right, I want my guy Franklin on the getaway. He can handle a bike. All right, if you vouch for him, I'll take the risk. Okay. So how do you want to do this? Run in through the front door or try to play it smart? I want to play it smart, you guys. I'm so sorry if that's something you don't want to see. But being loud, that just doesn't sound like a good idea. Ah, you've grown wise and cautious in your old age. Okay. Select personnel with that in mind. As ever, the better they are, the bigger the cut. Now the driver, they'll source the bikes, lead you out through the tunnels. All right. So, vehicle choice. What does this mean exactly? Driving skill. Um, he seems better in everything. Eddie Toe. Now you can count on him to get you out of a spot. Guns. Now we're hoping to keep quiet, so this guy shouldn't make much difference. All right. Well, he's only taking 7% of the cut, so... I really hope this doesn't mess up with, uh, <laughs> with the, um, I feel like I'm choosing the wrong guy, but he said it doesn't make a difference, but it's still gonna, like, this is the guy that's gonna screw up or something. Ah, Norm. Came across as, uh, yeah, a bit of an idiot, but could be useful. Hacker. Back office, but this is the person who will determine how long you get inside. Well, she's gonna take a lot of the cut, but let's do Paige Harris. Harris! <laughs> Good. Feminine touch. She'll be able to find any back doors they got. That look good to you? Are you sure? I'm very sure. Great. Uh, I'll do some research on the pest control van and the knockout gas, and I'll be in touch. Oh, yes. Huh? Good. Good. I'll call you when everything's ready. You'll need to pitch it to the guys. Whoa. What? My rep don't count for nothing no more? You're a dead man, Michael. I'll call you. All right, guys, so I think I'm going to go ahead and see what happens out here. At least I got silver that time. Hey, what's up? Hey, man, it's me, Michael. What's going on? Listen, um... I gotta get hold of the money for that house we pulled down, so well, I'm getting a crew together for, uh, you can guess. The pay will be awful, and the risk will be high, but you might learn something if you're interested. Man, that's not exactly a great sales pitch, dog. but I guess I gotta start somewhere. Thank you. Maybe one day you can put together your own deals, your own jobs. So, there's still some preparation I gotta do. Sit tight for a while. My buddy Lester will get in touch with the details. Hey man, what's up? Alright guys, so I think I'm going to leave it here. And I think the next time that we get started, we're going to be Franklin. So I will see you guys in the next part.